So we've got a mythical out in front of us and I've got the 30-30 and let's go and alert it. Yep, I think we got it. Okay, <laughs> 8 mythical down with a 30-30. But today's video idea is to go out with the really weird weapons like the 243 and two shotguns and obviously the 3030 which we just used but these weapons are mainly just weak weapons that we're trying to use on alligators which are probably the most toughest animal in the game so let's go and pick this one up and yep straight in the neck actually not bad penetration from the 3030 and the other one was straight in the jaw and I really wonder if anyone's ever made a brain shot or a neck shot through the mouth because I think they'll be really cool but first alligator down which is the 8 myth cool so that's pretty nice but let's keep going down this river and find some alligators and we've got another alligator in front of us not that one but that level 7 right there if we can spot it eh uh, can't really but I'm gonna attempt the 243 because I think it has a little bit more penetration than the 3030. No guarantees, but let's just try. And it obviously won't drop instantly if we do get any sort of vital. But we got it. It's doing that weird thing where they go instantly invisible as soon as they actually start floating. But I saw that. It definitely is down. Huh. That went down actually pretty fast. So, 243 is definitely not a horrible idea. Shooting a diamond with. But, yeah, that kind of boosts up my confidence that I can actually shoot a level 9 with the 243. Because that is my next idea whenever I find a level 9. I'm going to try to use the 243 or something weak like that because that would be pretty awesome. But let's try to make our way over here. It is pretty deep so it kind of sucks but let's just keep going and I believe this is a olive fur top and it is 396 not a bad one either and oh just barely nicked that neck. So I wouldn't try going for a 150 meter shot again because we were pretty lucky because we nicked it on one of the parts that go out from the neck. But still, another gold American alligator down with a weird weapon. And there's actually some more that is alert over there. But they are way too far out and we only have the shotguns in our loadout to use now. I will probably grab a few more weapons because I know a few more which no one really hunts alligators with but are ethical for them. But let's go around and try to find another resting alligator. And since we only have shotguns left, we have located a resting alligator. He is only a level 4 and I can't really spot him at the moment. but. He's around 160 meters away, so we're gonna go and sneak up to around 50 and try to take a shot and if the shotgun can't actually penetrate from 50 meters, I'm not sure if there's even a point trying. But yeah, let's go and sneak up on these dudes and, oh, this dude, and let's see if we can make this shot happen. And by the way, I'm not sure what's happening in the chat. I'm not sure how they can get knocked out so fast, but let's just ignore that and continue on. And we're getting pretty close now, around 70 meters away. I might just pop up and go for the lungs. But I might just get a little bit closer to around 50 and then I might just pop up and run at them and see if I can get a few shots into their lungs because I believe the lake we're at, they can't actually swim down. They should float back to us 
even if it's just a shot that kills them, I guess. But around 60 meters out now. I kind of want to try this shotgun. There we go. There it is. And <laughs> it's gone. I did definitely did not have a clear shot at this dude. So that was kind of a fail, but yeah. I'm not sure if you guys just saw that, but an alligator just came out running at me and I was able to put a few slugs into his lungs and he's actually coming back in. I wasn't able to put my mic on in time of him actually running at me, but we did get him down so that's all that matters. And this looks to be a dark brown I think. But let's see if I am right, which I am, I think. Yep, dark brown. And right lung shot. And there's actually only one lung shot. Just about double lung and also just about heart, but flesh on the other one. Oh, barely nicked the bottom of the heart. Oh, barely didn't nick the bottom of the heart. And we also got jaw and skull. And just skull. So, actually pretty bad penetration since it was 7 meters away, that should have definitely got double lung. But I'm not complaining, not a bad level 7 alligator down. Now we only have one shotgun to use, which is this one right here with the scope. Let's see what type it is, it is the Norden 20 SA Serviceman, I'm not sure if I said that right but that's what shotgun we're going to be using next, so let's see if we can get an alligator down. And I did just spot a level 5 American alligator down here, around 130 meters away, and I believe we can get into a lung from that distance. We'll go to around 100 hopefully, and that should assure that we actually get into at least a single lung. But we could probably do it from there. Let's just try it. Chucked another one in him just to make sure. And I'm not sure if we did it. Err. Uh, I don't think that got into a lung. So I guess that means we need to get a little bit closer. So I guess let's find another alligator and try to get into 50. And once again, didn't have my microphone on. But an alligator came running out and we were able to get it with the shotgun. And let's just go and pick this one up. It is just a female, dark brown. We actually didn't shoot a female this whole video so I guess it's good to actually get it. And we got a double lung on the second shot actually. Not bad penetration at all. And the other one we got lumbar, spinal cord and pelvis. So not the best shot in the world. But yeah, we did end up getting it, so that is pretty nice. So I think that'll do it for today's video. So if you haven't already, make sure you like, subscribe and do all that good stuff. And comment down below which gun should I take my next diamond gator out with. And yeah, I think that'll do it. So thanks for watching, and we'll see you all next time.